up a bit of for the sake of games. Before I start this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date with all motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram, Out from Fitness, and follow my band, Divide Dimension, on Spotify. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. Got the hoodies on deck. Boom, you can pick these up in the description. Like I said, everything you need to know will be in the description box below. Give the video a thumbs up. Doesn't cost you guys a fucking penny. It does help the channel grow. Let's get to the topic at hand. Havoc by Athletic Alliance, a Canadian company over here, guys. Canadian up in this bitch. All the way from the Canada, from the Maple Leaf. Havoc Neuro, okay? So they have two different types of pre-workouts. They have Havoc um, 137, and they have Havoc Neuro. This is more focus-based which we're going to go over in a minute. I do want to thank DJ over at Athletic Alliance for sending this over and giving me the opportunity to review to my channel. And let's get to the review today. This is a 23 scoop, 46 serving type A pre-workout. So if you double scoop, you're only going to get 23 servings. And the price point on this is $60. But if you use DJ 25, it will get you 25% off, bringing this down to $45. And let's face it, we're probably going to double scoop this. So that's $45 for 23 um, servings, which is almost $2 a serving. And I have to call a spade a spade here. That is on the higher end for sure when it comes to pre-workouts. $2 a serving, very, very expensive. If you double scoop this, you're definitely only going to get 23 servings. So it is about $2 a serving if you're double scooping it. And most people probably are. So I do have to say that... The price point is on the middle to upper range when it comes to uh, expense. So that is the price point. Like I said, use DJ25. It will get you 25% off. And let's get into the label. Citrulline Malate, 6,000 milligrams for two scoops. Nice nice dosage. Going to help with pumps and blood flow. Beta alanine, 3.2 for two scoops. Very nice dosage, can help with remove, remove lactic acid buildup, help you last longer in the gym, give you the beta tingles. Betaine, 2,600 milligrams, super solid dosage, can help with power output, overall performance. You have taurine, 1,000 milligrams, nice standard dosage. Agmatine, sulfate, 500 milligrams, gonna pair up very well with the citrulline malate. You have tyrosine, 500 milligrams, pretty solid dosage of tyrosine. It's gonna help with focus. Forskinlin, 500 milligrams. That's um, It's got a lot of benefits. Um, usually helps with asthma, so maybe it's in here for like breathing purposes, I'm assuming. I'm not really honestly sure. Caffeine and hydrous, immediate energy at 300 milligrams. Alpha GPC at 250 milligrams. Honestly, not a super solid dose to that. Uh, Alpha GPC is usually higher than that to get a very effective out of it, to get a decent effect out of it. 250 milligrams, obviously on the lower end. Theanine at 200 milligrams, like I said, um, theanine, it's, it's an okay ingredient, but if it's, um, this is a three to two ratio. So there's 300 milligrams of caffeine and 200 of theanine. So it is what it is. It's supposed to help with anti-crashing and to make you, <clears throat> um, not crash. And it's also supposed to take off the edge so that you're not getting super stimmed out. And it's supposed to kind of calm down that. So 200 milligrams, it is what it is. Huprazine. Um, at 40 milligrams at 1%. So that's a super high dosage of huprazine, and that is for focus um, and overall nootropic. Uh, Bioprene at 6 milligrams. Um, usually it's at 5 milligrams, so it's in a, it's definitely on the higher end, and Bioprene helps absorb everything to so that you can use all of the ingredients and get the most effect out of it. So <clears throat> the, the um, this is... Very, very focused base. So you're probably asking yourself, what is the performance? But before I get into that, let's get in, let's go over the red licorice flavor. Usually I would go into the test test, the taste test segment, but today I'm not going to do that. I did uh, trial this for three or four days and um, the flavor is very solid, very good. And it is a different type of flavor. So it, I, like this, I like to see flavors, uh, companies do unique flavors. Red licorice really hasn't been done. Um, and very good job on it. It's very unique and very different, and it is a super solid flavor. You're definitely gonna enjoy it. It's not, um, it's not super crazy, you know, flavorful and super crazy left field, but it is unique, and I do have to say that it is definitely unique, and they did a good job with it. When it comes to ratings with the with the red licorice, I would honestly have to give it a solid nine out of ten. It's a very solid flavor, very enjoyable. 
and most people don't give a shit about the flavor when it comes to pre-workouts, but I actually do. I don't think it's a make or break thing, but it does It does have some merit, of course, for me. Um, at the end of the day, effects do matter the most, but I'm going to call a spade a spade here, and I think that the flavor does matter in a pre-workout, and they fucking killed it. So that is the flavor, and let's get into the effects section, guys, the effects. Here we go. Havoc Nero, high focus pre-workout. Man, you get super fucking focused. Super focused. Super fucking focused, guys. Um, the pumps are in the middle of the road. The power output, the endurance, everything's in the middle of the road here. Caffeine and hydrous, the energy, middle of the road. Um, and honestly, the only thing that's not in the middle of the road is the focus. Super fucking focus. That is in the middle to high range for sure. And that's with two scoops, guys. Um, I think that this is a very, very conventional style feeling pre-workout, but with super nootropic and focus ingredients added. So if you're looking for that traditional type of feeling, but with super high feeling of focus and just productivity and effectiveness, this is right up your alley, guys. This is right up your alley. Very, very good pre-workout. This is, um, you know, it's not for the crazy stim junkies, it, but if you are been taking pre-workouts for, you know, I feel like this is an intermediate pre-workout, very, very intermediate based and possibly even beginner, honestly, with the one scoop and two scoop dosage thing. Definitely, you could probably get away with one scoop if you're a beginner, two scoops if you're immediate. This is not for the super stim junkies. This is not for the DMAAers, the DMHAers, the Uriah Gerenesis, the all the crazy exotic stims. This is not an exotic stim type of pre-workout. This is super conventional style feeling, but with a ton of focus. And when you're in the gym, you need to have focus because you need to know what the fuck you're doing. You need to get in, get your shit done and leave. Not go in, take a pre-workout, talk to your buddies, talk to this, do a set here, do a set there, then you leave because then you don't get shit done. This thing, Nero, and that's what it is. Super high focused. So think of a conventional style pre-workout. Think of everything in the middle of the road, very effective, um, just effective and productive. And then think of the focus and nootropic side of it and think of middle to the high range. That's what you're getting here, guys, at two scoops. And I feel like this is a great pre-workout, like I said, for intermediate for sure. Definitely for beginners if you do the one scoop, two scoop thing. And as far as stim junkies, this is probably not your pre-workout. Um, you know, if you scooped it a shit ton more, maybe, but at the end of the day, I'm only trying to, uh, base it off of the, the scoops that are here and the maximum dosage per the label is two scoops. So I have to call a spade a spade and say that this is for intermediate and beginners, beginner and intermediate. This is not for stem junkies or the exotic stem type of people. It's just not. Okay. It's just not. So that's my review. I do want to thank DJ for sending this over and giving me the opportunity to review it. Thank you very much. And other than that, that's pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support as always. I'm just want to see you next. If you'd like to fucking bad, subscribe, share, and comment below. Scroll below, scroll below, because of fucking swole. Follow me on all my social media. I'm Venice, Facebook, Venice, Snapchat, Instagram, Opperman Fitness. Don't forget to like my band page, Divide Dimension on Facebook. Follow my band, Divide Dimension on Spotify. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. Give the bit a thumbs up if this is your first time to the channel. Subscribe, like it, share it, comment down below. And other than that, guys, we'll check you guys later. Thank you.